fight coming up? No. Uh, as we all know, this is an X-Wing. Well, I hope everyone knows. Uh, and this is a Y-Wing. Now, if we try to put these somewhat nose to nose, actually we can do it like this. Uh, let this one lay there like that. And go away with the R2 unit. That's about nose to nose. And if you check in the back, the Y wing has about one centimeter in length on this. Oh, on the X wing, sorry. However, <coughs> if you put these nose to nose uh, upside down now I've cut off the engine on the Y wing they're about the same scale however How the heck? No, no, that's the wrong expression. Uh, yep, you can change them if you want, but I'm not. Uh, R two D two, in you go. I said in you go, and in you go. Okay, let's put him the right way. <laughs> uh, as I was saying, putting this, these are apparently to scale to one another, but to make it scale for, uh, not for, to the eye, I actually have to elongate them by this much I have figured it yeah uh, otherwise they're gonna look goofy so that's <clears throat> what I will be working on when I'm not working on this. One away. Come on. Mm. Be paying the ass Do I have to take out the hammer? There we go. So, what I will be using now, I know it's a flat rod, so.
problem is I think this is going to be too flimsy even though there will be four of them so I will ignore that and I'm going to use uh, those uh, L So, uh, that's why I have the milling machine. Uh, <clears throat> I'm going to make these end caps and uh, glue in here. And then I'm going to uh, hollow this out and shorten it and use this part for the stop back here. Uh, nice, warped, great. But that's where we are with the weapons right now and the hmm, cockpit isn't exactly kosher if we say that like that there is actually a dude in here I think yeah there's a dude in here does the dude want to come out nope he doesn't I don't think I can take out this this guy either. Actually, I think this is going to be Luke. Yeah, I could take him out. Yeah, <laughs> his butt rod came. So, 